Hello everybody. So today we will check it out again the displacement map and what we can do. So I will just create a simple shape. Yes. Okay, and I will apply a map. Simple map, something like a blend. But first of all, we will try to add displacement map great don't forget color space is raw alpha is luminance checked great and we just throw that blend on our plane great so what we will do next, I want to convert that plane to a uh, displacement map from displacement to geo. So, in order to convert that uh, displacement map to the geometry, we need to press only modify, convert, and displacement to polygons. Definitely, we need select first. So, okay, so we have one well, low quality conversion. Yeah, in order to increase the quality, definitely what we need to do, we will go and increase the density of the mesh. Yes, so probably four times, even okay, four times. How, how it will look then, I will go again, modify, convert, displacement to polygons. And let's check it out, what we will gain from such a resolution. Just in case, if you will think that doesn't work or uh, your Maya is stopped working or something like that. Now just check this out. Displacement to polygons was in the left bottom corner. That operation was in progress. Okay, so let's check this out. What do we have? And in here, as you can see right now, we have much more details. can see even uh, these ornaments and definitely you can go even more but uh, let's say not only with this geometry in order to increase the quality you will go to Maya standards um, standard uh, displacement map section so it will be on the when you select the object you will go to the control A you will go, uh, go to the shapes and you will go to the displacement maps. And in here you can see we have a initial sample rate, extra sample rate. If you will go higher, the higher time it will take and the bigger quality it will, uh, I mean the better quality you will have. However, it will take longer time. Okay, so let's go to uh, probably 9. It will be insane. However, I will try to do it. If I convert displacement to polygons. Okay, displacement to polygons. Let's wait. I will pause for a second. Alrighty, we have something. I cannot see very big different. So, don't know if that worked. Hmm. 
maybe okay so let's check how much polish do we have so under display heads up display i'll select the poll account and first shot was uh, 50k that will be oh jesus i i won't say it in english and as you can see it's a very drastic change great so as you can see you can convert without arnold displacement to geometry so just for your information you can do it and i'm using this technique already seven years probably and i cannot see any problem with that so let me know if you will use it or or maybe arnold is better and why let me know